Welcome to Singapore. The year is 2050. Your journey to a sustainable, energy-efficient, yet cost-friendly Singapore begins here. Take a solar-powered hydrogen hybrid bus to school. This bus relies on both hydrogen and sunlight for power, providing an environmentally friendly transport. On the highway, vehicles drive over pressure tiles, which generate electricity from the high kinetic energy transferred to them by vehicles. This electricity is stored in the energy storage systems under the highway to power street lamps in the evening. With the heavy foot traffic at the entrance, our school utilizes pressure tiles just like those on the highway. Electricity generated powers lights and fans in the school compound. But to ensure energy security so our lights don't go out suddenly, we tap on regional power grids. Here is a selection of the regional power grid, which transports electricity from neighboring countries to Singapore. When we use regional power grids, we can tap on cheaper energy and green technologies abroad. In school, just like all other buildings, there are chutes for food waste. Several central incineration centres are scattered across the island. There, food waste is incinerated to release thermal energy to produce steam, powering steam turbines that produce electricity. Carbon dioxide released during incineration is collected to produce environmentally friendly concrete for buildings. Artificial intelligence is used to detect and minimize energy wastage. All buildings have advanced smart meters installed. It tracks the amount of energy used and produced by the building to ensure that it can be more self-reliant. Since Singapore cannot harness hydroelectricity conventionally, we use water turbines and pipes transporting clean water, harnessing the potential energy of the water flowing from the rooftop to lower floors. Energy produced will power the building so that it is self-sustaining. It's been a long day. Why not cycle through the city? Street lamps made of self-sustaining solar cells release the solar energy absorbed during the day to illuminate the night. Ahead, you see the liquid natural gas energy plant. Natural gas is a critical source of energy and will continue to be part of our energy story while we explore greener technologies. Combined cycle gas turbines are hard at work to produce more electricity. But why can't we rely on natural gas forever? This energy is non-renewable, so when it runs out, Singapore will be plunged into darkness. So if we can ensure energy security, environmental sustainability and price competitiveness, we can make our city shine again. It's our energy story. Ours to create. What innovations will tomorrow bring, fellow Singaporeans?